opportunity to hit the ground running in terms of grade level. They were required to pay the company a sum of 1 million naira. <laughs> Welcome to my channel. What's up? It's your girl Chi Amaka. Now I know that some of you fell as you were running to this video. <laughs> I know. Stand up, rise up, soldier, and take a seat. See, it doesn't matter whether you're at the back or at the front, wherever you are, I got you. I got you. <laughs> okay, so I make videos about career self-development, vlogs as well, everything fun and everything serious on this channel. Okay? Hmm. So we all have this thing where, especially for graduate trainees, before you take an offer, you want to know what it entails. You want to know how much they pay, which most of these companies do not like to sound the alarm. So basically, you do not know how where you're getting yourself into. You just go through the process, dive in, and all of that. Anyway, anyway, I took it upon myself to create a survey and send out to people to sort of um get responses as to how much they pay if there is a bond in their company and all of that right that's um what we have in today's video so i had not a lot of responses so roughly around 35 um there's this thing in nigeria about people don't want to talk about how much they earn i don't know why that is but either way i respect their their feelings but since this was completely anonymous i guess that's why certain people responded so just to reiterate absolutely and completely anonymous so i don't even know who responded to any of this i didn't collect email addresses and all of that or names or anything right um so we're just going to get into it i wanted this to be like an introductory video before i do the main video but i think we should just we should just get into this so for this video we're going to be focusing on banks yeah i think that's how i um separated it we're going to be focusing on banks assets bank um first fcmb i have guaranteed trust bank here polary stand big sterling uba and wema <laughs> so if you're looking forward to any of these graduate training programs take a seat guys take a seat sit down let's let's dissect how much these people are paying now this survey was taken roughly maybe a month no two three months ago it is important to know that some companies have increased their salaries good example is zenith so you may not apply to them i don't even have zenith here hmm hmm okay but it's important to know that some of them have actually increased their salaries i don't know if any of this i'm not i'm not familiar if any of these guys i have on my list have increased their salaries the only one i'm very unfamiliar with is zenith i don't have zenith on this list and i don't know if they what level they increase their salary to but anywho anyway let's just uh, delve into this now for the for this um reporting for this um system um let us start with let's start with women now this person's response where my bank okay some things we need to note what is a bond a bond is something your company asks you to um sign what it means is that you have to stay with company within a certain period if you do not stay within that period you pay them a certain sum of money right yeah that's a bond so they want to keep in the company because they've spent so much on you during training they want to keep in the company for a stipulated period usually two years um if you don't want if you stay less than two years even a year six months excuse me they'll ask you to pay two million one million and all of that but for more information about all of this i have a detailed video on my channel that talks about graduate training and you want to check out that video guys you want to check out that video okay so this response from when bank when did you join the company um this says 20 when did you join the graduate training program this is response for 2020 2023 training period was for um, one to two months so i used the range right one to two months did you do the job rotation the person said the program has no job rotation um yeah but the person still picked one month for job rotation so i'm guessing the person just wanted to pick anything there's no job rotation basically so um question how much were you paid during training school um 51 to 100k I remember sometime in 2021, Wema's graduate training program was 50K, except this has increased. 
all right their graduate training program used to be 50k yep so um monthly salary on full employment 151k to 200k so it's a range note that some companies on full employment before confirmation and full employment when you've been confirmed salary changes right for some banks and some places but this person's so i didn't i didn't specify give all those dynamics but for this year 151k to 200k that's the range person this thing so one next question is flexibility of choosing your department so you come into a graduate training system want to know did the company give you that flexibility to say oh um pick whatever department you want to work in or we have so so vacancies in this unit where would you like to work and this person says no they weren't given the opportunity to decide where they want to work if you're seeing me looking that that's because i'm looking at my laptop yep did you sign a bond there was no bond um, person said there was no bond but this says one year or two million that's weird um let me try to think when i was there a bond i know i had gotten into when my graduate training once upon a time i didn't go i was just into there's a time i was just applying <laughs> to test my skill and all that was there a bond i think there was i think there was and i think it's I, it's actually this one year or two million but i could check that's not an issue are you happy on the job yes the person is happy and i left space for a general comment because of course this person goes seeking a suitable supervisor to support completion of formative and summative assessment teaching and learning tools and application forms so basically what this person is talking about is whatever role they're in someone who understands what they are doing that's my own understanding of the plenty grammar somebody who understands what they are doing that can put you through and i think that's one thing some places actually lack they just throw you into the gut and all of that up next is uba okay so all of the responses from uba are people from 2022 to 2023 that's when they joined the graduate training program that's pretty recent right yeah so um how long was training school five to six months that's the um, training period um job rotation okay so two people said they did they moved around the different apartments for a while and um two so i had four responses and another to said no there was no job rotation so i'm guessing it's likely that um uba has a job rotation system but what happens is when they get in there's already work waiting for them so there's supervisors there's no time to even rotate some people like just get into it of waiting for you i am guessing that's likely the case with this now there is a question of um how much are you being paid during training school um also 51 to 100k so we can't really say exactly how much that is all right um, how much is your uh, monthly salary 301 to 350k okay that's surprising because i wouldn't have thought that uba pays that much for graduate training but yeah that's this person's response 301 to 350k okay so there's a mix of response um from the four responses two people said three people said 301 to 350k and one person said 251 to 300k so my guess is probably they're in different units and they are being paid differently that's probably weird but what we do know for a fact that it's not above 350k so let's say UBA pays 300 let's just take that all right were you given the opportunity of choosing your units nope they weren't um they signed a bond <laughs> they all signed a bond um all of them have one year or one million except for one person who said um 15 months and one million so 15 months is not up to two years um that's like a year that's like a year and three months extra so so to speak um let's just say so to speak basically they signed one year and or one million so if they leave within the period of one year if they've not stayed up to one year in employment with uba 
they were required to pay the company a sum of one million naira that's what that means are you happy on the job some said maybe every other person says no general comments on your experience what you would like them to improve on and all of that what you would like them to improve on and all of that and this person says to the management there should be proper planning as they made a lot of people resign from their former place of work only for the graduate program to be postponed indefinitely five months and this has always been why i tell people to go for other options if they have any damn that's that's intense and it's and this person isn't lying it's quite it's quite common right with so many so many graduate training programs it seems as if they really do not care about you right they just do stuff without informing you and all of that and most times people who do graduate training programs aren't people who are actually struggling for a job these are people who are working and probably just need to leave where they are they just want something else and it's supposed to be a graduate training program you think you're going to have like you think you're going to be prioritized actually and then you get there and you're not prioritized it's common the next comment someone else made from UBA is, if I had known better, I won't choose UBA. Definitely won't recommend to anyone unless they want sales. To so management, GTs are not. Okay, so this comment now is to management. So the first comment was to us, every other person out there, that uh, if he had known, if they had known better, they wouldn't have chosen UBA. Um, definitely they won't recommend it to anyone else except the person who wants sales now this is to management of UBA GTs are not magicians to meet your high target so I'm guessing that is through this person into sales <laughs> guys you don't know how bad it is until you're being thrown into sales really and giving high unrealistic targets with actually no help right then you would understand why things why this person is actually complaining so i can definitely relate to that oh can i take all the banks in this video <sighs> okay let's see how that goes next one on my list is sterling and this um, person joined the program 2022 to 2023 the training program lasted for five to six months and uh, job rotation they were supposed to um to job rotation but he or she ended up staying in one department all through um, the period of the job rotation how long was the job rotation the person didn't select anything because of course nothing to the person didn't, didn't, didn't do the job rotation i wish they had selected those so i would just know how long it was supposed to be either way during training school this person says they were being paid 51 51k to 100k right so salary upon full staffing and all of that so for sterling 251k to 300k so within that range that's where the salary falls on them option to pick their department nope did you sign a bond yes <laughs> a lot of graduate training programs will hook you with bond how long was the bond one year or one million so if they if they, if they leave the employment within that period they will be required to, to pay one million are you happy on the job maybe general comment i can't say hmm. wish you had said though okay so next on our list is um, the response both of them okay one is from 2022 to 2023 the other one i have one from 2020 to 2021 um training school also one to two months did you do job rotation yes both of them did how long was the job rotation five months and above yo that's wild training school is one to two months okay i think that's still fair so it means that they prioritize their job rotation over the training classes and i actually wish a lot of companies did that i don't know i might be wrong for some other people but i feel like the actual job rotation helps but it that's if they will stick with the fact that it's a job rotation and you're learning on the job you're not actually on full employment here because what most people do during job rotation is just to use you because during job rotation they're most likely still paying you what they're paying you as a gt sometimes all right 
so they just use it for that period giving you target like full-time employee but your employment will not be counting from job rotation it's not weird anywho how much were you being paid during training school 51 to 100k how much is your monthly salary so this this is monthly i forgot to mention that right how much is your monthly salary on full employment 350k to 400k yo and that's the highest we've had that's the highest we've had right since we started this you guys okay were you given the opportunity to speak at the department so the one from 2022 to 2023 said yes and the 2020 to 2021 said no okay did you sign a bond nope nope are you happy on the job yes yes hmm so 2022 to 2023 says best experience with stambic ibtc so far i love my job so so much hmm <laughs> That's such an amazing review for a company, right? Now, the other one is the other person from 2020 to 2021 says, yeah, would definitely recommend. Stambi gives GTs an opportunity to hit the ground running in terms of grade level and the culture is the best so far. Ah. Do you know what it means to give a company this amount of positive review? that's a lot guys like that's a lot of positivity in the review and one thing you need to know is that people leave graduate trainees okay people leave one bank's training school to join another bank's training school so when they are saying this is the best they've had it's because they've experienced being a graduate trainee at another company and they actually leave to another company's graduate training and start all over in fact they go through the graduate training system right finish job rotation we start working while they are there they start applying for jobs they don't see they, they apply for a new another company's graduate training and start all the way from training schools are the experienced people but because they know what they're looking for right and they do this so you really need to take this um these people's review seriously like the the review on stambic my oh my <laughs> awesome polaris 2022 to 2023 training was for training school was for one to two months there was no job rotation um they were being paid 50k during training school and um upon full employment the range salary range was 251k to 300k option to choose their department no they didn't also sign a bond are you happy on the job yes general comments there should be practical trainings to help the students more okay we have that let's now move to gtb <laughs> or before we even get to gtb let's do fcmb don't worry we'll, we'll get to gtb the response from fcmb 2022 to 2023 um training school was three to four months there was no job rotation and then this person said job rotation was still one month. I guess the person wanted to select anything. So no job rotation. They were paid 15K, 50K during the training period. Upon full employment, salary was 100 to 150K. What year is this? 2022 to 2023. Whoa, that's, that's low. I don't know. But okay, this person says 100 to 150K. They weren't given the opportunity to choose their units. Also did not sign a bond. Um, are you happy on the job? Yes. Person says yes. Okay, dogs. Now we have two more companies left. Access Bank and Guarantee Trust Bank. Which are we going with first? Grrr, anyway, now is the time where you subscribe to my channel and you leave a comment in the comment section. You share this video with others, with your friends. I know this is something everybody really wants to know like you want to look for this information nobody see nobody will tell even your friends by the time they get this graduate training job they won't want to tell you and i don't i really do not know why that is though but okay let's Garage. go on guarantee trust bank gtb 2022 to 2023 training period was for um one to two months and during that training period they're being paid between 51 51k to 100k the program had no um rotation right and upon full employment 251k to 300k was what they were being paid um opportunity to choose department nope 
so they weren't giving you the opportunity to choose the other part man they also did not sign a bond which is quite interesting they didn't sign a bond are they happy on the job yep that's what they said now any other comment spence says on the scale of five that they would give um guarantee trust bank a four yay like that is such a sweet review now this is the second best thing i don't know if the second best thing after stand big but this is also an amazing stuff i don't know i like when people give employers because we talk about toxic employers right but we also do not talk about employers who are doing great and all of that so when i see people actually compliment their workplace i i just have this thing in my heart where i'm like oh okay so there are still amazing workplaces out there which people need to tap into and now the final one for this video <laughs> Or second to the last one for this video is Access Bank. Give it up, guys. I know this like GT and all of these are actually common graduate training programs, right? But I know most of the people here, yeah, you fail coming down here because of Access Bank, GT, and all of that. Anyway, here's Access Bank's review. I would start with the with the one that is like offshoot. This person's response from 2017 and below, right? All the responses I have, Access Bank has the most response. And every response I have from Access Bank is 2022 to 2023, which is why I want to take 2017 and below first. Okie dokes, okies. I'm really enjoying myself doing this video, guys. I do not know. Please subscribe to my channel. Though. This took a lot of work. Subscribe to my channel, enjoy, and tell me other videos you would like to see. And I have videos about NYC. I have videos about getting your first job, financial planning, all of that. Please go and watch my other videos. Enjoy, enjoy, enjoy. Okay, looks. <sighs> okay, so 2017 and below, um, training period was for three to four months. During that period, they were paid between 51k to 100k. There was a job rotation during that period. Yes, I moved around. That was, the pe that was the person's response. For a period of one month, the person was moving between departments and trying to learn what they do. Upon full employment, how much are you paid? This person says 301k to 350k okay were you given what's this were you given the flexibility of choosing your unit nope did you sign a bond yes content of the bond two years or two million <laughs> so two years or two million are you happy on the job no general comments the job has been so stressful nearly all my colleagues in the same unit have fallen sick within few months of being employed hmm. okay 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 so let's take one of the 2022 to 2023 or let's see what's common among them so um 2022 to 2023 how long was the training um i have five to six months i also have somebody who said three to four months which is same as the 2017 below so but most of the responses speak to oh so you know access bank has like different types of training but access bank has like different kind different types of training so it might not speak they have a general one they have um specific to tech and all of that because i'm looking at this and i'm wondering why the responses are different but i think that might just be the case but either way 2022 to 2023 how long was the training i have three to four months i also have most responses are five to six months and the other person okay so i'll take this last this last access bank separately because the the comment the response seems to be um quite different so i have three to four months but most of my responses are five to six months and during that period they were all paid 51k to 100k that's what we paid for um as a graduate training okay so as regards job rotation no the program had no job rotation for most of the responses but i have somebody who said yes i moved department i moved around departments for a while now how long was the job rotation of course the one with no job rotation none so i'm saying one month i also have three months i also have i have one month i have five months and above right i also have them here but it would be weary access bank doing um, a three months rotation okay but yeah so basically i have three months job rotation and i have five months and above here i don't know if i'm handling this well i hope you're not confused how much were you being paid during that period during period of training all of them 51 to 100k standard 
na how much monthly salary or full employment so um constant across board is 201k to 350k look what begs the question here is the person who picked 2017 and below picked uh, 301k to 350k except the only explanation for this is maybe as of 2017 they were they weren't putting this kia whole thing on them where you had to get like a car and then it's taken out from your salary that's the only thing i can think about that that's the only thing i can think about for this but well a lot of response will turn around 1k to 250k yeah that's the only response that's the only thing i can think about for for this right okay so the next one is um were you given opportunity of choosing your unit nope did you sign a bond they all did they all signed a bond you was their bond two years or two million mm. so they have seen employment of assets bank for a period of two years or they pay two million which reminds me, when I was talking about Wema, right, I was trying to remember the context of their bond, right? It's actually one year or two million. Yeah, it's actually one year or two million. Because I remember receiving the offer and I'm like, eh, for what? Like, two million. You even say one million, let me even manage to pay. Yeah. And I don't think, yeah, I think I think it was the two million that was the problem. So, but across board for, for GT, it's two years or two million. Um, are you happy on the job? Nope, nope, nope. The other person says maybe, and one person says yes. Okay, so let's read why. Why the yes? Let's read all the yes, yes, yes we have. I think that would help things to perspective. Or let's just read your comments in general. Okay, so this person says I'm not happy on the job. Next is. They should consider choices of GTs before dumping them in any units. Like I said, this is a big problem for all, for most GT programs. You might be lucky to get a unit you want, but you might not be lucky. Because it's a GT program, they've trained you guys for a lot of things, right? A lot of marketing, um, finance, treasury, this, this, that. At the end of the day, you just find yourself, maybe you're looking forward to marketing, you just find yourself dumped in treasury. You are looking forward to treasury, you find yourself in investment banking. You are looking forward to investment banking, you find yourself like they just throw you anywhere and money must be made. You've signed a bond, you have no choice, you have to stay. Okay, so this person who says maybe says the targets are crazy for a newbie. So um you might not directly be in a sales unit, but you might be in a unit that has targets. Or, the, or something might be happening and they give everybody targets in the bank. You work in a bank, guys. Yeah, so that's where you are being saddled with that responsibility to come up with maybe 15 million. And that is me being nice, actually, because people are being... <laughs> 15 million is a joke in a bank, right, for a target. And they have to come up with that one way or the other. Remember, you signed the bond. Okay. Um, this person says no. And reason being, there is no proper onboarding, not learning the way I am supposed to. I feel you. I feel you. So you can, I feel you. You can see that there are certain statements that are constant across board. Some of these responses we're getting from different training, different companies. So it's not just one company. From different companies, there, are, there, are these um, responses are just similar. Now this other person says, I asked if they would recommend this to, if they had any comments or if they would recommend this to anybody. And this person said he's satisfied with the job and yes, I will. So they will recommend Access Bank to somebody out there. Okay, so we're gonna take the final Access Bank that I said was a bit different. This is from 2022 to 2023. There was, um, everything about the training was on the job training. The program had no job rotation. And during that period, they're being paid 121 to 150k. That's the range. So, which is almost the same thing as when they got fully employed into the company. They didn't sign a bond. They weren't given the opportunity to choose their unit. The context of the bond was to stay in the employment of the company for one year, or they pay a million naira, right? If they want to leave before a year. Are you happy on the job? Yep. 
general comment i had on the job training because of the need to begin work immediately oh i see so they needed you and they brought you in so no job rotation just come in and it was one year or one million which is different from others who have done two years or two million right others were being paid so around 1k to 250k and this person was being paid 121 to 150k roughly right so yeah you can see that there's a slight difference between that person and the other guys in terms of training the job duration um how much they were being paid the bond as well the person has one year one million others have two years or two million and the person they're all most of them are happy with the job okay actually this person is happy with the job others are not somehow maybe okay so we've run through all the banks i have here access fcmb gtb polary stanbig sterling wema um uba right we've run through all of the banks that i have here and one thing we can say for certain is that people aren't exactly satisfied with um what they've been given with what they have currently stanbig has the most satisfactory um, comment i'll just like to read their comments again one person says best experience with stomach eye so far i love my job so so much <laughs> and this other person says yeah we we'll definitely recommend stambi gives jesus an opportunity to hit the ground running in terms of grade level and the culture is the best so far yeah these comments are definitely not from me this comment are from the um, the stuff I did. I'll leave it on the screen here. I did a survey, and that's where the responses are from. Yeah. So you guys, you guys, and most the good thing about this is that most of them are recent, 2020 to 2023. Highest paid on this list um, during full employment is actually um, those within 251 to to 350k yeah and those within the benchmark right and there are quite a lot of them uh, most of them oh i have 350 to 400k which is also stambic i'm sorry uh so stambic since they are the highest paid on full employment and um most of them the next one after that that has 301 to 350k is within uba as well i have some response from uba as well um second best bid on this list and then the rest of them 201 to 250 okay i need to look for something to 300k guarantee trust bank polaris as well um they come up next before you start having the likes of access bank the least paid on this list is fcmb yeah they are the least paid on my list from the responses I have here, both for job training and both for um, full employment. Yeah, the group of people that do not have a bond is also standing the best paid, satisfied with their job, and also do not have a bond attached to them. Maybe if we had had more responses from Stambik, I don't know if that would have affected. If you've worked with Stambik, um, please let us know in the comment section. Um, what it's like yeah or if you know someone who has worked there i know i i know every review i've had about them because always been positive really um yeah so to speak yeah people with the highest bond of course access bank two years or two million every other person is one year one million for but from here it's two years or two million yeah i don't know if i want to do worse comment this might not be a fair representation of all the graduate trainees um, the clusters right or of all the people people might have different experiences because the way you feel about your company also is determined by the people you interacted with your branch your bank your your team your core team right that also matters but anyway anyway the comments are comments are there and i've listed them i hope you did have fun on, have fun on this video as much as i did like i had so much for fact when i was reviewing this and i'm like yeah 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 <laughs> i had so much fun making this video like you can tell that i'm currently having fun now if you are out there and 
I know a lot of people have like four or five offers from some of these graduate training programs. I hope this will help you make an informed decision, right? And also you could make more research out there. Just because someone's experience is negative doesn't mean that everybody's experience in that particular company is negative. Okay, if there's any other video you want me to do, I don't know, let me know in the comment section and I'll find a way to go about it now 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 it would be rude it would be bad though if you don't leave a comment to comment section you can't drop a comment thanks <laughs> okay but we are not done this video is done but we are not done right so watch out for my next video and in that video we're going to look at in that video we're going to be looking at those within the capital market so we've done banks right we're going to be looking at um insurance companies investment banks so to speak and all of that juicy deeds yeah okay let's just watch out for the next video all right guys it's a wrap <laughs> it's a wrap for now i don't feel like leaving but it's a wrap for now and i'll see you in my next video bye guys <laughs>